All right, folks. Let's make this quick. How to annotate? Yay! <sighs> you know what to annotate. You uh highlight what's important. All right, identify keywords, so you know what's going on. All right, you should know this by now. Underline keywords, box unfamiliar words, put a star next to something that's important, put a put a question mark next to something you don't understand. I never heard of this before, but I guess you can. Put an exclamation point next to something that strikes you. Provide a brief note. Explain the connection. That makes sense. Know what a key word is. It's an important word in the sentence. Know what a key phrase is. It's an important phrase in the whole work. Look, yesterday, in the park, the cat ate the squirrel. Why are these words underlined? Yesterday, that's when it happened. Park, that's where it happened. The cat, cat, that's who did the action, ate squirrel, that's what the who did. Underlying keywords, all right. Who is this paragraph about? What did they do? When did they do it? Try it for yourself. Press pause and read. This is what you should have underlined. When, once upon a time, there was a dear little girl who was loved by everyone, who looked at her, but most of all, her grandmother. You underline this in red over here. Why? Because it's who number one. L-R-R-H. Little Red Riding Hood. And there was nothing her grandmother would not have given to the child. Once she gave her a little cap of red velvet, which suited her so well that she would, you know what, I told this to the class. This is bougie right here. This is a wrong she, okay? That's supposed to be Little Red Riding Hood because there's too many pronouns. You get confused. But here's the whole point. Underline when it happened. Underline who's doing the action. Underline who's the who number two. And what Little Red Riding Hood did. All right. And you can write on the side, okay? Look at the continuation. Your grandmother, she's ill and weak. Why is that important? It might foreshadow that the grandmother is going to get hurt. Do not run off the path. Why is that important? It's going to foreshadow that Little Red Riding Hood might go off the path. All right? Whenever you watch a movie and they say, here are the rules. Do this, don't do this. Don't do this. And whatever you do, don't do this number three. You know in the movie, before it ends, the character is going to do work number three. All right? Look at the last sentence. And don't peep into every corner before you do it. Person underlined this because they're asking... Why is her mother giving this advice? I'm not sure, but I think it foreshadows something important. So even if you're not sure why it's important, underline it if you think why, if you think it's important. And uh, they boxed peep because she didn't even know what a peep is. Everybody knows a peep is one of those marshmallow chickens you eat for uh, Easter. Here's the definition. Next, turning annotations into notes using symbols. Next, turning annotations into notes using symbols. If you know how to text, you know how to write in code. Congratulations. All right, why do we do this? So it's faster. Here are some symbols. The slash means here's a new idea. Plus means and. Equal means equal to. Duh. The little arrow over here means it leads to. This means down. This means up. A four-year-old could figure this out. All right. Then you try to play around with it. Try to write this in cold. Show studies is a study of the past. Press pause and read the rest. Now, here's what's important. Yay, the who, the what are they doing, the when. Here's the answer. Show studies is a study of the past. Corrupt government and weak leaders lead to the fall of empires the black plague led yeah, yeah excuse me the black plague led to a decrease in the population of western europe now you try it what does this mean i'll tell you what it means press pause if you don't want to know and figure it out yourself too late adidas and nike are popular brands of sneakers a snowstorm leads to a decrease in school attendance Yay. Have fun taking notes. Deuces.